ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, and all those that may fall in between, I'm no time dad, and I've got the nerve to show my face around here. What's going on, guys? How you doing tonight? So we got Fall of Usher and Orgasmo up in the house. So, uh, so it looks like last time, after I talked to this girl and successfully recruited her, I didn't save, but I saved right before it. So, this will be the perfect time to see if the extension's working properly this time. Stop! Not another stepper out! Wait. This you. racist elf. You're one of that lot who were attacking the ship. Suddenly, you see what she sees. <laughs> feel what she feels. <laughs> that beard. I love it. Hostility. Uh, because you are Gith. The manliest ah! Gith ever. No. You were on the ship. Captive. I can feel the parasite in your head. You tried to get my pod open, didn't you? Probably wanted to kill me and loot my corpse. Don't. Racist, Come any racist, racist. Oh. oh, look at that. It's working. Make your choices. Yeah. Well. Well, well, well. She's going to die or we're going to die. <laughs> oh, boy. Critical miss. That's that's what I like to see. Just, just hide, hide in the corner. Oh! Oh, she got me with the crit. Oh no. And I've already used my bonus action. I think I think I'm dead. I think I'm dead. Yep. <laughs> well. All right. What do you think? Same option, or uh, or are we gonna change it up? Suddenly. Ah! You tried to get my. Probably wanted to kill me and loot my corpse. Don't come any closer. I will. I mean, we can we can suffer all night long. I'm a okay with that. I've seen your kind's handiwork, and I won't fall victim to it. Get away! Hello? My kind was attacking the enemy. Wouldn't diplomacy be a bit more logical? Attacker, move back. I'm not interested. She is not interested in diplomacy. We got persuasion. The gate tadpole is the true threat, not me. Intimidation. You are free to strike the first blow, but I will strike the last. Persuasion. Divide and conquer is a time-tested strategy. Will you walk into your own defeat? Four, attacker. Five, move back. Dun, 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 dun. Roll it. Oh, nat 20. Say you didn't leave and we didn't come to blows. <laughs> what then? She's uh shaking in her boots now. She can't handle this the threat of this beard. This jerry curl. We will survive together. And be stronger for it. Change your mind and attack. Or leave without her. What? Thank you. you. <laughs> I suppose there's plenty of other things that are set on killing me around here. Fine. But understand that I'll cut you loose the moment I have to. Understood, snotty ass. I'm Yankee Adams. Let's make haste. How did you end up on the ship in the first place? Best to pool our knowledge. What do you know about the tadpole? Get the Yankee knowledge. What do you know of my kind? Our matter on this plains are well concealed. Give Yankee a fine name, strong and without pity. We will see if you live up to it. Four, six. You know, I think I'd rather take my chances without you. 
They sure give you, make sure to give you all of the options to just dump somebody. In case, in case they say something that you just don't like. That, uh, pull button is right, right over his, uh, erogenous zone. I know enough to know I have to keep an eye on you. I am Yankee Adams. Let us change. make haste. Understand? Oh, jeez. Okay, they ran away a little bit. Alright, one dead. And then he misses. Like a chomp. Boom. Plow. Ooh, six damage. Yikes. Oh, nat 20. My girl. Oh, nope. Shove didn't work. Eldritch Blast. All right. Intellect Devourer's dead. Oh, are these fishers eating the mine? What is going on over there? Come on, Dink! Faster! Get her out of there! Ah. Uh, it's mind controlling them. Don't die. Don't die. Don't die. Step back. I'm here to help. Draw your weapon. Keep quiet. 100%. Yeah, it's working a lot better this time. I might have been, uh, like, doing a clean launch after enabling it. Might have helped. Uh, let's see. Let's go after her. She's got the lowest health. Oh, she's too far. What? No, she's right there. Critical miss. Yes. Let's go engage these guys. For why? Suddenly, something convulses inside you. Your vision lurches. Oh no! You are one with your assailants. Your minds fused together. They are frightened, lost. The creature in the wreckage is forcing them to attack you, controlling them like puppets. Its voice shivers across <laughs> your brain. I don't know why I didn't think about attacking this dude on the ground. Will to its bidding. Put down your weapons. I don't want to hurt you. Wisdom. Focus your mind. Try to break its influence. Continue fighting. Wisdom. A seven. Oh, this is... This is easy. Easy peasy. There we go. Nailed it. The presence in your mind gropes for purchase. It gropes and for purchase. That is disturbing. You push back, taking advantage of a tremor of pain that cuts through the creature. As its influence wanes, your assailants lower their weapons, blinking in confusion. Well, I'm glad you guys didn't have to die because I almost murdered the little one. <laughs> it was sky and and then the voice oh god the voice what happened Boop. you tried to kill me that's what the monster was using you like a puppet it looked like you were helping that thing this voice what was it saying obviously it was saying kill them all right it was calling for help it sounded just like my daughter, but she's been dead for oh, years. Oh, wow. That thing got into our heads, drove us mad. We wrecked our boat just trying to get close to it. They're already, uh, cutting deep. Going for the feels. It could be worse. Your ship didn't fall out of the sky. <laughs> first things first, where are we? Your boat, can it be repaired? Start by handing over your valuables. Not sure why it's not doing this from my character's point of view and it's doing hers, but whatever. 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 Chance. It's bloody driftwood. 
And we're in the middle of nowhere, and even... Oh, wait. You. Uh oh I can feel you. Just like one of those things. No, I'm not. You're one of them. Well, I mean, she's one of them. One of them racists. What? I saved you from that thing. Calm down. They abducted me, but I escaped. Show some gratitude, or you'll find that I'm a lot worse. It's hysterical villagers, man. You went to hell and then fell out of the sky on fire. And they had the bad day. Calm down. They abducted me, but I escaped. There's something in your head. Please, we'll take our chances out right. here. Just, just leave us be. Thank you. Get out of here. Oops. Can I? Can I just leave? There we go. Leave turn-based mode. Oh, here's the mind flayer. Let's, uh... You approach the dying Gaik. The foul thing is at your mercy, and you would have its head. You could end its life here and now. If only you didn't feel compassion. Compassion? Compassion. <laughs> I like that that was they they reaffirmed that, right? If only you didn't feel horny. Give in to the emotion. This isn't right. Step away. No, you should be furious, shouldn't you? Oh god. Oh no. Oh no. It's happening. Well, poor creature is on the brink of death but there's still time you'd give your life to save it to nurse it back to health but then the feeling slips the creature's mind seems to focus elsewhere well that's rude we wanted emotions concentrate on its thoughts maybe i can make it bend to my will oh i have a plus two in intelligence so this isn't too terrible. Wonder what the uh, DC is gonna be. Oh, eight. Oh, <laughs> and roll the seven. You try to break through, but its mind is impenetrable. With a last surge of defiance, it slaps your efforts away. The monster lies exhausted, defeated. Its eyes, wet orange pearls, radiate malice. Close those eyes forever, or leave it to die slowly. Close those eyes forever. Two votes in. Ah, uh, curb stomped. The Jerry Curl of Justice. Don't know what I'm ever gonna do with those, but I've got them. Please, please come and help me. Oh, it's this dude. Hurry. Hello. One of those brain things cornered. There, in the grass. You can kill it, can't you? Like you killed the others. Easily, stand back. Kill it yourself. You look capable enough. Or just leave. We don't need you around anyhow. Oh, 50% 50, 50 leave, 50%. Kill it yourself. All right, let's, uh. I was hoping for a kind soul. Well, not uh. to worry. Oh, snap. Oh, snap. Dexterity, quickly roll away. Strength. <laughs> Oh, these are not good. These are not good. Oh, man. <laughs> oh. Do nothing. Hold me. Hold me in your arms. Not a word. 
Let's try to keep that lovely neck of yours in one piece. Hmm? Now. You flirting I with me, bro? The ship, didn't I? Nod. Shake your head. Or headbutt the elf. I feel like you guys just hate vampires. This is this is definitely quite the predicament. I'm sure if you tried to go and kill the thing and walked ahead, there was really nothing there, and then he'd do the same thing. All right, 100%. Headbutt. 12. Dun, dun, dun. Wait, roll again. I can roll again. Hey, a 16. Interesting. You son of a... You son of a... Your mind twists. You're looking out of unfamiliar eyes, prowling dark, busy streets. You try to hold the memory, but it fades to the worm. The light. The fear. <laughs> what was that? What's mm -hmm. going on? I don't know, but something just connected us. Honestly, I have no idea. Put the knife away and I'll tell you anything. Or everything. There's no option for... Was, was that a... Was that a pen in your pocket or were you just happy to see me? Something connected us. It was that it warm was embrace. Monsters. Whatever they did to us caused that link. And making me the small spoon too. felt so good. I saw it during whatever just happened. And to think, I was ready to decorate <laughs> the ground with your innards. <laughs> Time to Apologies. make a double connection. Apology accepted. I might have done the same if roles were reversed. Glad to see we're all caught up now. You better have more to offer than apologies. Like these nuts, 50%. All right, my my mouse was closer to the bottom one. I flowers, so I hope an introduction will suffice. My name's Astarion. I was in Baldur's Gate when those beasts snatched me. Starion. Introduce yourself. Tell him your name or nod. Hmm. <laughs> Astarion, yes. <laughs> quite, quite. The strong and silent type. All right. Please tell me you at least know something about these worms. Yes, unfortunately, they'll turn us into mind flayers. I know we don't want them in our heads. You know as much as I do. I'm surprised out of all of those that those ants that uh, everything's going as well as it's gone. To... <laughs> <laughs> of course, it'll turn me into a monster. What else did I expect? Although already a monster, it hasn't happened yet. If we can find an expert, someone that can control these things, there might still be time. Control it? We need to get rid of it. You should travel with me. Our odds are better together. I need to get moving, but you can shelter at my camp. I've wasted enough time here. Farewell. That, that grimace. <laughs> Ooh, I feel like how much we've been flirting, this is kind of the better option. You can shelter at my camp. We can shelter together forever. I was ready to go this alone, but maybe sticking with the herd isn't a bad idea. Safety in numbers, after all. And I hate to turn down an invitation. All right. Maybe I'll see you there. Good luck. Oh, he's just going to show up sometime at my camp. Neat. He wants to eat my neck. Done. 
Boom! Oh, critical miss. Who's who's mad at me for killing a pig? It's food. Yeah, I mean, it looked like that, but I'm like, I mean, maybe this is like a story point and I just ruined it. Hmm. Holy bacon. Let's move up here. Eldritch Blast. Dang, boar, dang. Ding. Pig's head. Eat. Baked, baked in the finest oils and sprinkled with spices. Oh, because he was... He was... <laughs> He was uh, he was uh, scorched. Uh, oh, it's scared, not seared. I thought he was a seared boar from uh, all the fire around. All right, it's not as funny now. But weird that his head is already cooked. Nope, oh, a dead goblin. Three dead goblins. Very nice. Oh, here's a quick travel. Ah! You're alive. That's unexpected. Last I saw you, you were lying in a It's handsome mage. Blood. An intellect devourer nibbling at your ear. Glad to see my eyes deceive me. I'm Gale. Well met. Well met. You were on the ship as well, I presume. Where did you appear from? You don't trust him. Draw your weapon. Too many handsome men throwing themselves at me. Do. <laughs> Everything's, everything's going great. Everything is fine. Everything is, is all right. Ooh, easy. Easy does it, lad. You really, really don't want to do that. Not a threat, just an observation. Besides, oh man, Grizzly or Yankee Adams, Adams looks pissed. Statistically speaking, we're anomalies on par with a convivial So pissed. Abolath. Sheath your weapon. And why would I really, really not want to attack you? Three, attack! <laughs> Inquisitive face. Hmm. Why not attack you? We'll get to that. I have a much more pressing question first. Are you perchance a wizard? To be more precise, an arch wizard. No, I'm no wizard. Arch or otherwise, why do you ask? If there's one thing I don't care for, it's bloody wizards. Warlock. I'm better than a wizard. I'm a warlock. Seems to be the better, the best choice for sure. There's a gust of weave about you, but it's a mere breeze. I need a tempest. Oh, you? I'll have to wait. Primary need is a healer. I take it you recall the insertion of the parasite? Rude ass condescending bastard I recall it yes vividly there could have been <clears throat> that could have all been an illusion and a bad dream that's my business nachos nachos wiggly beard wiggly beard that could have all been illusion the I'm the rooster right illusion no doubt, but I assure you what happened to us was quite real you know what happens next it is to be avoided I assume you're no accomplished healer either. Powerful cleric, maybe? Can't say that I am. Why can't you just use magic? <laughs> Look, is this a conversation or an interrogation? Dude's just hard pressed. Hard pressed to get up in my healerness. I'm like, no, bro, I just said I'm a warlock. Get out of here. No means no. Just trying to figure out where we stand. Conclusion, nowhere. You and I are in a whole lot of trouble. <laughs> I agree, Yankee Adams. Adams. I agree. Wilderness. How about we embark on the quest for a healer together? That sounds like a plan. You're welcome to join me. No, thank you. I'm not looking for another traveling companion. Why isn't it? No, thank you. I don't need a pompous ass like you up in my business. 
I know you just insulted me like five times during that conversation, but yes, let's do it. Let's Most excellent. get this quest together. Ado, let's be off. Besides, looks like you keep some interesting company. A woman with shadows for eyes, deep as the dark lake. Pleasure, madam. You can have her. She's a racist. Oh, level up. Okay, so we know we want agonizing blast. Mage armor. At will, without a, spending a spell slot, seems. Seems like the way to go. We'll go with armor. The armor of Agathis. All right, guys, what do you what do you think we should make the wizard? Should he go evocation or abjuration? Burn it up. Ray of sickness. Should probably put feather fall in here somewhere. Get rid of grease and do feather fall. Yeah, we leveled up. Let's uh, let's camp. Camp for the day. Get our vampire in our group too. This seems to be a good place as any. This seems as good a place as any to make camp. Oh, hey, he actually voiced over that line. Exclamation point with the wizard. Go to hell. What a dick. And good evening to you too. Was there anything in particular I did to deserve such a greeting? Watch your damn mouth. I brought you on the team to do the dishes. Not run your mouth. Ha, <laughs> you're a good sport. Go to hell. An everyday expression. So trivial, it's almost meaningless. But we've seen hell. It's real. It isn't trivial. Hmm. That's true. Not trivial at all. What's on your mind, Gail? Did you say your name was Gail? Gael. Oh, Gail. Watch the flames in silence. You sound a tad more dejected than when we first met. Uh, fun times. Merely contemplating. Devils, dragons, mind flayers. They used to be abstracts. Pictures on a piece of paper. What a difference a day makes. Now we have tadpoles slithering through our heads like carnivorous feti. That's not abstract. I'm not too worried. We'll find someone who can help us. Perhaps you should get some rest. Brooding will get us nowhere. Action will. What can I say? But that you're right. We're in deep you know what. Can't say the S word. Norty Norty. Brooding. This ballet of flames invites reflection. Be all right. Let's be up with a lark. Find a healer before the wee one gets hungry. Nope, here he is. He just showed up. He didn't even bother to, uh... Oh, now she's got an exclamation point. Hello, racist. Let's have a chat. I'm not sure this is a good idea. You're not sure what is a good idea. Relax, this camp seems safe from threats. Don't fret, we all need some rest. Don't question me. Oh man, my hair's tripping out. The shadows. There are lit fuses in our heads. Sooner or later, they're going to blow. Each hour that passes, the thing inside us grows. We need to find a healer. Let's wake up at first light. That was the plan. Agreed, our top priority, as far as I'm concerned. Fine, but it won't be easy. Searching the wilderness. This is unfamiliar territory. Rushing will only land us in more trouble than we can handle. Maybe. Fine, but, but it we might get won't be easy. We're overdue some good fortune. Rest well. We'll need our strength. Well, thank you for the kind words, racist elf. This is very sweet of you. Hey, bro. Shadow heart seems jumpy. Must not relish the thought of sprouting tentacles. Understandable. Can't say I'm a fan either. 
It's just hard to join in when all of this feels so new. The night normally means mm -hmm. bustling streets. So new new. Bursting taverns. Curling up in the dirt and resting is um a little novel. Give it a try. We'll need to be fresh tomorrow. Rest or don't. It's up to you. Give it a try. I'm in no place give, to give, rest, give it a try. Today has been a lot. I need some time to think things through. To process this. You sleep. I'll keep watch. Yeah. The pleasure is all mine. Cinematic pending. <laughs> Oh boy. Well, I guess it's time to get eight on. He didn't bite me. And he didn't join the party yet. He's just showing up at camp for a while. Hello. You're not twice as tall as me, but I'm off the bloody backbone. But we don't know what that thing even is. And what about the crypt? I'm telling you, it's a ship. And the crypt can wait. Mari and Barton have been trying to break in for days. Now we stop. <laughs> so intimidating. Ourselves competition already. I don't know what the hell's you are, but that's our ship. Oh, look at them options. I mean, no harm. I'm just looking around. Persuasion. That ship is full of monsters. I wouldn't go near it. Deception. I think that ship's an invasion force. Run while you can. Intimidation. The only thing you own is your life. Leave before I take that too. Yeah, Yankee. That's my kin's prize, not yours. Or Warlock. That ship's full of poisonous vapors. Probably demonic. I'd stay away. Or just seven attack. Poisonous? What? See? <laughs> that thing could be carrying a plague for all we know. We're, uh, we're leaving. Come on, move it! I You're more cunning than you look. I thought we had a fight on our hands. Well, I mean, I'm a warlock. What is this cracked stone? I'm going to have to find a rock to throw at this thing. Shazam! Let's see. You hide. You come over here and hide. And you Go open the door. Oh! Nat 20! Oh, she's, she's done. Oh, no. And they're attacking her on the ground too? Oh, these guys are stealthed and they're not in combat. Well then, uh, that, uh, I should have forced the turn based. Whoops. Whoopsie doodle. Firebolt him. Wait. Wait. Fire bolts. Wait. Hey, someone's in here. Alright, good shot, good shot. We'll run over here. Wait. And Dorn. Oh, she likes to stand in fire too. Very nice, very nice. Ignis. 
All right. Well, we're we're going we're doing pretty effective right now. We're we're doing all right. Are you just gonna you just gonna stand there? Hey, she's back. You come over here and healing word yourself. Ooh, we got him. Ah. All right. The sun had just fallen below the horizon when I first heard its call. A thousand reed pipes all at once, whistling a single beautiful, terrible song. Uluthalonk. And said jaw, it's coming. Jaw dropped her pack and scurried up the nearest biter. With a bit more effort, I climbed a tree of my own, and the two of us surveyed the grassy ground beneath. Ah, woo! There it was again, above and beneath and all around. So close, my skull vibrated from the sound. The ferns and foliage under me rippled and swayed. Jaw held a finger to her lips to demand my silence, and in one motion, it snatched her. A vine? A tentacle? It hardly mattered. The hunter had found its prey. Jaw's screams swelled, then faded as Ulu Thalonk dragged her away. I leapt down to give chase, but the creature left no mark behind. The grasses were untrampled, the shrubs unbroken. I had only the memory of that harrowing call to guide me. Though a bloom of mold has leached the ink for most of the scroll, its beginning is still legible. The sealing ritual, ritual. Our god cares not for petty ritual. There is only the sealing, and it is vital that we observe it with exacting reverence. On the day of the sealing, a mixture of bone and ash is consecrated. Upon the names of the dead, we spread the offering, imbuing the ink with the essence of death of our god. Sweet, sweet. So we're uh, definitely in a cultist ruin. Nothing bad ever happens in a cultist ruin. It's just pure facts. No lock, no handle. How does it open? Hmm. With fire. Ignis. I am the master of puzzles. Oh, it's dark in here. I'm a, I'm a light. Light these candles. There's another door. This wasn't built for the living. Oh, dude, this crypt is so dank. And that is where we're gonna call it for tonight. We'll pick up sometime next week, though. So Dark Souls on Monday. Watch Party Wednesday. And then Baldur's Gates Friday. Thanks for choosing some dialogue choices with me, guys. And hanging out. There were some pretty funny moments so far. And uh, we're alive. And I want to give a huge thank you for your time. And as always, remember to laugh, stay kind, and have a wonderful day.